In the Valley of Peace, a land in ancient China inhabited by anthropomorphic animals, giant panda Po Ping helps his goose father run their noodle restaurant, but dreams of fighting alongside the Furious Five, Tigress, Monkey, Crane, Viper, and Mantis, a group of kung fu masters who live in the Jade Palace, where they are trained by Master Shifu, a cranky red panda. One day, the wise tortoise, Master Ugwe, the founder of Kung Fu, predicts that Shifu's former snow leopard protege, Tai Lung, will escape from prison and attack the valley to obtain the Dragon Scroll, a legendary artifact said to grant limitless power to its reader, which he had previously been denied. Panicked, Shifu sends a goose named Zhang to increase the security at Chorgam Prison in Mongolia, where Tai Lung is held. Shifu holds a tournament for the five so that Ugwe can identify the dragon warrior, the prophesied hero worthy of reading the scroll. Po arrives too late to enter the arena. Desperate to see his idols, he accidentally launches himself into the middle of the tournament off a chair propelled by fireworks. With the townsfolk believing Po descended from the sky in a fireball, Ugwe proclaims Po the dragon warrior, much to Po's and the master's shock. Shifu believes Ugwe's decision to be an accident, and the five dismisses him, so Po considers quitting. However, after receiving encouragement from Ugwe, he endures a frustrated Shifu's harsh training, and gradually befriends the five with his resilience, culinary skill, and good humor. During this time, Tigris informs him that Shifu's distant behavior stems from his shame over Tai Lung's betrayal, having raised him from infancy. At Chorgam Prison, Zhang's warnings are ignored. Tai Lung escapes and kills his guards before sending Zhang back. Shifu informs Ugwe, who makes Shifu promise to believe in Po as the Dragon Warrior, before ascending into the spirit realm in a stream of peach blossoms. Shifu informs Po and the Five of Tai Lung's escape, and tells Po he is the only one who can stop him. Horrified by this lofty goal and Ugwe's death, Po attempts to run away, but Shifu stops him. Po eventually breaks down and makes Shifu admit that he does not know how to train him to be the Dragon Warrior. Tigris overhears this and leads the five in a secret attempt to stop Tai Lung. Meanwhile, Shifu discovers that Po is capable of impressive physical feats when motivated by food, and successfully trains Po by incorporating these feats into an innovative kung fu style. The Furious Five fight Tai Lung. However, Tai Lung ultimately defeats all but Crane, who carries them back with his nerve strike technique. On returning, Shifu decides that Po is ready to receive the Dragon Scroll. When Po opens it, he discovers that the scroll is nothing but a blank reflective surface. Believing the scroll to have no power, Shifu has Po and the Five evacuate the inhabitants of the valley while he faces Tai Lung alone. Trying to console a distraught Po, Mr. Ping reveals that his secret ingredient soup has no secret ingredient at all, explaining that things can become special with belief. Realizing that this is the message of the Dragon Scroll, Po rushes back to help Shifu. At the Jade Palace, Tai Lung brutally defeats Shifu, but discovers the scroll missing. Po arrives with the scroll, prompting them to fight. Po proves to be a formidable opponent, frustrating Tai Lung with his confusing fighting techniques. Tai Lung eventually obtains the scroll, but does not comprehend its blank surface and tries to take his frustrations out on Po. Po overpowers him and sends him to the spirit realm, using the legendary Wuxi fingerhold technique, which he taught himself. Po is honored by the valley, and relaxes with a recovered Shifu.